It's been a week of acknowledging and honoring our nation's veterans, and in Dallas, a direct act of support for veterans and their families we want to shine a light on tonight. Our Steve Pickett is live for us in southeast Dallas with a sizable example of the kind of support that we're talking about. Steve? Uh, truly neighbors helping neighbors. These volunteers here today, and we watched them for a couple of hours here, Doug, all of them from Home Depot out here today, putting the work in, putting the, the action behind the words of supporting our veterans, in this case, the widow of a veteran. This neighborhood is not like it was when we first moved over here. And James moved to this house on Beauty Crest Circle 44 years ago. On this day, she's getting a little touch up, a little help from strangers, volunteering to sustain the homes of veterans or the widows of veterans, like Miss James. He came back with no visible scars. All of his scars was internally. The men and women here today did not know Army veteran Sherman James. <laughs> But they dedicate themselves to repair and remodel homes that house veteran families. Every person here is a Home Depot employee, part of a partnership with Rebuilding Together North Texas. It's just a great opportunity and it's a great part of, part of our company to really allow us to get out into the community and help people who have been dealt a raw deal and really need some support and some help. I think this program will benefit to many, many people and will help them to live in their house longer. I am very, very happy and I am so appreciative. Miss James is 84 years old. She has glaucoma. She wanted to have the house painted so she could sort of brighten it up so she could see better. Well, she can see clearly now based on the work that was done on the inside and wanted a little privacy on the outside with that new fence. Those volunteers from Home Depot, that fence, all done. Reporting live, Steve Pickett. CBS 11 News. Steve, thank you. Don't you just love our neighbors? I do. Yeah. And you, the, the good in people. The good in people is always there. And, you know, it's a good thing that they went outside, they did that work.